Hello and welcome to the Abstract Medic YouTube channel. Please be sure to like, comment and subscribe and please check out my other videos if you find this one helpful. So today we're going to be discussing acute exacerbation of asthma. So imagine if we have a 23 year old man who has been excessively wheezy and he is a known asthmatic. So what he does is he takes his salbutamol inhaler. He takes one puff that doesn't help. So he waits and takes another puff. And unfortunately, this still doesn't help. So what he does is he goes to the hospital and he's given oxygen. The target saturations are between 94 and 98%. So in, he inhales this oxygen and is also given nebulized salbutamol, about five milligrams. And he's given this alongside ipratropium bromide at around 0.5 milligrams as well. He continues to inhale this, but if you can imagine what the next step would be if this patient doesn't get better, it would also give them oral or IV corticosteroids. This could be oral prednisolone or IV hydrocortisone. But imagine this patient still doesn't get better. We would like to give them IV magnesium sulfate. And this is a bronchodilator that's given IV as mentioned. And as this patient takes this, unfortunately, if this patient doesn't get better, the next step would be to take them to ICU where they will be given IV salbutamol or aminothelin. And unfortunately, if this patient still doesn't get better, then we might have to consider intubation. Thank you so much for watching this YouTube video. Hopefully it helped. And please be sure to comment, like, subscribe and take care. Bye, everyone.